Hey guys, I'm Jacqueline. And I'm Marcella. And today, we're going to talk to you about the TV shows we are currently watching that are really good and we think you should be watching too. Yay. Watch a lot of TV shows. And we're going to go through it by the days of the week just to make it easier. <laughs> just so you know what our schedule looks like. On Sunday at 8 o'clock, we watch Once Upon a Time. And now we're going on like the ending of season five we're on, right? We can't we won't give spoilers in this no. video either. But it's a very, very good show and it is on Netflix, so you should go watch it. It's basically like fairy tales. Fairy tales, but they all have their own different spin on it. It's like this girl and she moves yeah. to a town and um all the town is actually there's characters the town is called story bro yeah and it's all stories that we've known like as a kid like growing up like the fairy tales and it's a very it's a very good show it's very addicting it's changed a lot different characters have been put in and different yeah. characters have been taken out and it's really developed a lot and it's very very, very it's good. a lot of fun to binge watch too once upon a time oh yeah oh yeah but that and like it's it has like a twist to it too it's not just like you know, the typical fairy tales that, like, you say. No, it is very different. There's a lot of romance. There's a lot of action. There's epic storytelling. Really good ships. Very good <laughs> ships. Captain Swan forever. Yeah. And it's just, it's a very fun show. You should watch it. 10 o'clock, we watch Walking Dead on AMC. If you don't watch Walking Dead, what are you doing? It's like, everybody awesome. watches Walking Dead. It's, like, probably one of my favorite shows that are currently Literally, when you watch it's it, you'll just like scream like it'll be like don't go in there don't go in there oh yeah and you just scream and it's like daryl rick and you just scream like everybody's name and it's a lot of fun to i watch. we watched the first season like a long time ago it's a very intentional never you know if you have watched the first couple episodes and you weren't into it give it another try go back and watch it because i actually started watching it last season with my parent with my dad and my sister and it was like, and then I went back, and then I rewatched it all in like a weekend. We binge watched it too. We didn't get sleep for like, like a whole weekend. We just watched everything was Walking Dead. <laughs> Go watch Walking Dead. It's a fantastic show. Monday, we have been watching. Um, we watch Married at First Sight. Uh, that's a very different from what we actually <laughs> watch. It's like the only reality show. Ish. Basically, these strangers, and basically, you get matched with somebody who is compatible to you. And they meet on the day of their wedding. Yeah. So literally, <laughs> when they walk down the aisle, it's the first time they're they meet. They're married at first yeah. sight. And it's on its third season, and it's very yeah. interesting to watch, like, how the how their, like, dynamics are with different people, and how they get to know each other, and even though they're married, and all the struggles that they go through. It's a, it's a fun show. Because they're I getting mean, to know each other, but they're married, so it's like they're yeah. living together, but... Like, going through everyday, yeah. work, everyday like, work, dinners, like, family, like, life, like... It's a pretty interesting and, show. Yeah, and at the end, you see if they want to get, get they get can either divorced. get a divorce or they could stay married. Yeah, it's a pretty interesting so, show. So, like, you root for your favorites to, like, yeah, stay married. Yeah, it might be on demand. And then on Tuesday, Tuesday's a very good day for TV. <laughs> 8 o'clock, we watch The Flash on the CW, which is awesome with Barry Allen and it's, Grant Gustin, who's yeah. very hot. Um, it's a really fun show, The Flash. It's kind of like a lighter tone. We always tell people it kind of reminds us of Smallville. Yeah. I don't know why. You it kind of have like... to keep watching it, too. Like, it gets better as you yeah. go along. Like, yeah. the first few episodes, you have to kind of, like, you know, watch, like, a couple before you actually can get into it. Right. Mm -hmm. Also, watch New Girl on Fox, which is really fun. It's a hilarious show. Yeah. We're it's on... only 20 minutes, too. Yeah, we're on our fourth season, I think we're on. But it's really funny. And I, I love <laughs> Schmidt and Nick. Yeah. And Nick and Jess are great. And, I, and it's just a fun show to watch. I mean, we love, like, Parks and Recreation and, like, The Office. But there's really not like a good 20 minute show on anymore. So yeah. right now it's really New Girl that I'm loving, and you know that's that's a fun show to binge watch on Netflix because it's only like 20 minutes. Then Shadow Hunters, we watch Shadow Hunters at nine o'clock, and I can't believe that we can actually say that because like I know. it feels so like we've surreal. waited so long to have like a I good know. adaptation of those books. You know the movie was like uh, yeah. <laughs> it's so weird because like. For years we've been reading the books and now we can say like, oh hey, I watch Shadowhunters, do you watch Shadowhunters? And it's like somebody who doesn't know anything about the world is just discovering it for the first time can be like, yeah, yeah I watch Shadowhunters too. Like, it'll also crazy. bring in more people to read the books too. Yeah. They'll, they'll watch the show and be like, oh that looks cool, it was a yeah. book first, and then they'll go read yeah. the book. And then, after Shadowhunters, we've got Teen Wolf. Teen Wolf! 
Teen Wolf. We Teen Wolf is another show kind of like Wolf. the oh feeling my... you get when you watch Walking Dead. It's just exciting oh my and you God. get pumped and you're just like it's, ready. Okay, I know that the the name of it, Teen Wolf, like it doesn't sound yeah. very good. It's like it's, it's like mis teen... it's misleading the name of it. It's the very show. misleading. It's so good. Mm. And it even when it's like bad, like it's just fun to make fun of, actually. Yeah, I mean, it's just you know what? Like, once you're with it, like, a long time, like, we've been watching it for, like, for years. years. So, yeah. like, you get, you, obviously, you grow attached we're to the characters. Season, we're on season so five. So, we just, like, care about the characters now, even <laughs> though, like, the show isn't as good as it used to be. Wednesday, we watch Arrow. Arrow. Arrow's on the CW at 8 o'clock. Another superhero show. Fair and that's a good one to binge watch on Netflix. It is on Netflix. I remember mm -hmm. we, um, we watched the, like, Back to back to back to back to back. And so that's our Wednesday. I think Wednesday we don't really have much to watch. I guess we kind of catch up. Kind like, of like our catch up. we used to have more? What else is on on Wednesday? The 100 used to be on on The Wednesday. 100 was on but on Wednesday. But now the 100 has switched to Thursday, so... Um, that Thursday. brings us to our Thursdays. <laughs> Thursday we watch the 100. Oh my god. <laughs> it's, it's so such, much it's so fun. Great. It's like... It if literally you, lost with teenagers. Yeah, like, if you haven't watched it, it, it's basically about these 100 kids, and they live in space, like, because, um, the Earth, what happened? What did happen? It was, like, It was, like, I don't know, there was just somehow. something wrong with it. Yeah, something <laughs> happened with the Earth where, like, civilization was, like, wiped out, yeah. and, um, you know, these people survive, so they wind up in space, and then they send 100 refugee kids down to, like, test out the Earth and see if it's livable again. So, you know, it's about these kids, and they go down, and all the issues, and there's, like, these other people there, and... Yeah, it it's literally, it literally lost yeah. with teenagers. Like, it's just awesome, mm -hmm. and the drama's a little bit more, um, more fun, and I don't know. It's just an awesome show. We also, on Thursday, we also watch Grey's Anatomy. Grey's Anatomy is... We've been with Grey's Anatomy for the so longest long. time. We've watched Grey's Anatomy for years. It's on season 11, and it's still it's still an amazing show. It's still phenomenal. It's still perfectly written. The, it's, the characters are different, and it's grown so much when it first started off. Like, we've been watching Grey's Anatomy. Like, I remember when it was going on season 6, season 7, season... We've been with it for so long. Yeah. I'm, like, so dug into Grey's Anatomy. Like... Oh, it's one of my favorite. And it's crazy because, like, you remember these characters when they were interns, and now they're, the, like, the doctors, and they have their own interns, and yeah. it's just weird because it's, it's like, it's you literally good. watch them, like, grow into their yeah. career if as you, doctors. If you think you don't like doctor shows, go watch Grey's Anatomy because yeah. it's actually, like, not really so much into the medical stuff. It is, obviously. It's, it's kind really of, like, half part. the medical stuff and then half the drama. But there's the drama. It's, like, a good balance. And the characters are just yeah. so real, and it's just... Oh my god, that show's made me cry so much. Yeah. Like, Shonda Rhimes is a great writer. And yeah. speaking of Shonda Rhimes, we also watch How to Get Away with Murder, which is another really fun show. It does take some time to get into, I will say. It's a mystery, and if you're not, like, the best with, like, mystery yeah. things, it does get kind of annoying, because it's like, you want to just know, like, what's yeah. going on. Yeah. But if you stick with it, it's like, it's, oh, it's so intense. It's and you just Yeah, you just want to know what's going to happen, so you just want to keep watching it. It's a fun it's, show to binge watch. It's a good show. Yeah. It's really good. I feel like that's all we're saying. It's a fun show to binge watch. You guys no, should watch these shows, I mean, though. Like, I mean, it's good. I think every, sh mostly every yeah. show is fun to binge watch, because it's like, yeah. you don't want to wait to see what's going to happen, oh, obviously. Yeah, no, no. To get into scandal. That's the only show on the show that I don't watch. Like I need to That's watch. That's the Scandal. next one. That's the next. I gotta one. watch that. Well, we're we're right we're, right now. We're currently watching Jane the Virgin, which is hilarious so far. So maybe after Jane the Virgin, we'll go and we'll watch. Um, yeah, we'll watch Scandal. We're, we, we're always watching new shows. Yeah, always. and then I got Fear the Walking Dead, which returns in April. That I gotta catch up on. There's only six episodes of season one, so now's the perfect time to watch it. You're stressing me out with all these shows. I you need know. To watch. <laughs> <laughs> I always feel like I have TV shows I've gotta watch. And then on Friday. Rain is on, which we're kind of we're behind like a season of that. Yeah. Like it just got added. It got added to Netflix recently, so yeah, I might catch we up. We might. I, I got uh... we got spoiled that somebody dies. I'm not gonna say because I don't want to spoil it for anybody. Like we were spoiled, and now I'm like I don't even know if it's worth catching up because I love the person who got who died. Like I didn't love the person that got died. I that did. got died. <laughs> that, <laughs> that got, got died. English. That got no, killed. that died. Yeah. Oh, Saturday, we watch Outlander. 
We yeah. love Outlander. We're waiting for it to return in the spring, and it's a really great show, too. We haven't really read the book very much. Like, I've read, like, the fa maybe like the first, like, 200 pages, 100 pages, 150, something like that. I'm in the middle of it. It's good. It's just a lot of detail. Yeah. So much detail. I want to read it, though. Like, that's, like, one of my goals. Like, I need to... I do want to read it. But I'm also really loving the show, so... I, I'm loving the show right now, mm -hmm. and I'm really enjoying Sam Hugan. He's very yeah. beautiful to look at. We saw the Sam cast, Claire. actually. We got to see the cast. We went to the premiere of season two, for the sp for, uh, season one for the spring when it returned. We got to see the whole cast come up on stage, and then we got to watch it in like, it a movie It was strange, theater. though, because they weren't dressed cool. as the characters. No, so, like, yeah. when we saw When we saw uh, we, Sam Hugan, he wasn't dressed as Jamie, and we were like, a little confused, <laughs> because yeah. he was dressed like in like a suit, mm -hmm. it was like funny. Yeah, but it was cool, we got to go in and see, like, it was in like a movie theater, it was like yeah. a big premiere That thing. was a really fun The whole thing. cast came up, and it was awesome. You don't know what Outlander is, it's this girl from the 1940s, and she's a combat nurse, and then she gets sucked into the Highlands. <laughs> And she meets Jamie, who is Scottish lassie, and it's just it's a very good show. Good show. If you like history, you would love it. If you, even if you don't like history, you would still love it because it has adventure yeah. and romance, and it's a great show. You don't feel like you're learning about history either, but you actually do. No. Like, you learn about what it was so, like back then. So those are all the shows that we watched. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks. Please subscribe and give us a thumbs up and let us know what shows you're watching. Yeah, and let us know what... recommend some for us because we're always watching new shows. Yeah, like, let always. us know what shows we should watch and if you're watching any of the same shows that we're watching and what you think of them. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Are you sleeping? Can I go up there? Wait, you should start working on the other one. No. Oh, I'm gonna go. Hi guys, I'm Marcella. Why can't I never go first? <laughs> I'm just waiting. Hi guys, I'm Jacqueline. I'm Marcella. It's You're Jay. Jacqueline. I'm Marcella. Yeah.